get back to the eclipse coverage. Everybody's talking about it. We're less than 48 hours away from the moon covering up part of the sun. Here in the Bay Area, we'll be able to see some of it. Some of it. We're some not going to the totality. But yeah. as we mentioned earlier, you'll need special glasses. But will your eclipse glasses work when you need them on Monday? Astronomers say you can check them right now. Consumer investigator Chris Kimura shows us how. With reports of counterfeit and fake eclipse glasses out there, you might wonder about yours. Are they legitimate? Are they dark enough to protect your eyes? Are they too dark that you won't see the eclipse? The American Astronomical Society compiled a list of eclipse glasses that passed lab tests and should work. Snap this QR code to see if your glasses are on the list. Also look for this stamp, ISO 12312-2. It's an international science standard for looking at the sun. But here's the thing. Anybody can print on eclipse glasses that their product meets that standard. How do you know that it really does? The only way to know for sure is that it's gotten tested. Dr. Rick Feinberg is on the Society's Solar Eclipse Task Force. He said you can run a basic test on your eclipse glasses at home. Step one, start inside and put the glasses on. If they block out everything, you should be okay. Now on to step two. Step outside. Take them out and take a brief glance at the sun through them on the next sunny day. If the sun is comfortably bright, you're almost certainly fine. But what if you go outside for a test run and your eclipse glasses block the sun? If you can't see the sun through it, you know that you've gotten defective glasses. You should try to get them replaced if there's time, but we're getting so close to the eclipse, it's, we're kind of running out of time. If you can't find a new pair, borrow someone else's. Eye doctors say do not try everyday sunglasses. They're just not strong enough to safely watch an eclipse.